So guys, I have a really big kitchen organization Amazon haul. I have been wanting to update my pantry for years. I just live there and all my walls are bare, have nothing on them. So now I want to invest in my home. So I've literally started a whole separate savings account that's dedicated to just like my apartment or like home investing, home investment. And home investment can mean several different things. It can mean actually like buying a house, like investing in a home. It can also mean just like investing in my home. like my current home. So I'm kind of saving for two things, I guess, which is definitely dangerous, probably not a good idea. This is a good first thing to do in regards to investing in my home. Just because I'm always in my pantry all throughout the day, every day. Like it is something that I'm always opening and I always feel this like, ugh, with like this organization. And I've learned I really need to be organized. Chaos isn't happening because everything is organized and everything has a place. Yeah, not even gonna lie. I've been holding on this for almost, it's definitely been a few weeks. Airtight food storage containers. It comes with seven pieces. There's one tall container, two medium containers, two small containers, and two mini containers. I'm so excited, like that's cute, right? Now let's go with this small box that's like much heavier than it looks, honestly. Pull it out. Ooh, my cereal storage containers. I'm so excited about this because I do have a lot of cereal. And I'm a cereal girl, like I love cereal. So these, this is airtight, crystal clear, BPA free, smooth pour pout, spout. That's why I got it, cause I like the pouring thingy thing. Stackable design, shatter resistant. I didn't know about the shatter thing, but shatter resistant is cool. So yeah. I also got this wrap organizer box. Three in one dispenser holder with label stickers. So this is meant to hold like my aluminum foil. It's meant to hold my like saran wrap and like plastic bags, things like that. It's bamboo and it helps to organize. It says no more junk drawers. Make all your bags or wraps organized, neat and tidy. And then this box is also a box in a box. What is this? Now I'm not gonna lie, I did drop this box when I was um, bringing it up from the mail room. I hope nothing's broken, honestly. <laughs> okay, oh, these are the little baskets, the bamboo baskets. First of all, this looks like a cutting board, right? But this is meant to go on top of like a basket. So cool. Oh. This is the basket, you know? Pretty sturdy and it has like a label thing for in front so you can like label what's in there. I guess I need to buy some chalk. It comes with two, so it's the same thing in there. One, two. That's everything. My arms hurt now. Whew. Now to break down these boxes.
grocery haul. Captain Crunch, but like with berries. That's important. English muffins. This is not the whatever. Spaghetti for what I'm cooking tonight. I always buy this for like school for lunch because it's quick and it's microwavable and it's yeah. Lifesaver recipe beginnings, but like the Creole version because you know. Sausage patties for breakfast. And you know, English muffins plus sausage, boom. You don't even have to go to McDonald's. And you don't even have to go to Starbucks because uh, they make it. They use it really good. I hate that. Milk. Strawberries. We're on a healthy kick, you know? Blueberries. Red seedless grapes. I love grapes, I'm not gonna lie. Romaine lettuce. Yeah. These are bone-in pork chops but like thinly cut, you know? Three of them. Raw shrimp, creamed corn. Two of these. Then I got four of these. I'm learning the benefit of buying and stock, you know? Running out of space. Half and half. I use it to make this really good corn and shrimp soup. Ugh. With potatoes, it's so good. This is mostly like a school snack purchase so that I can eat this with lunch or on the way home. Cause usually like on the way home from school, I'm starving, I'm not even gonna lie. Truly, honestly I haven't, ooh, I'm gonna drop this. <laughs> honestly, I haven't had this in like years. The reason why I bought this is because I'm getting ready to go to a baseball game on Friday. So I don't know, I just figured this would be a cool like, I don't know. <laughs> and that's my grocery haul, now to put everything away. <sighs> but for real though. Now I'm gonna unload the dishwasher as well while listening to this really good audiobook. It's called The Power of Vulnerability by Brene Brown. Highly recommend. So I just finished like organizing my pantry and I'm not gonna lie, it really did take at least two hours. I don't know how long I was expecting it to take, but as soon as I started the process, I was like, dang, this is about to take a second. Anyway, I just finished it. Now I'm about to do like a, an at-home seafood boil because you know, in New Orleans, girl, I really am addicted to seafood. And because I live in Texas now, I think it's better for me to just like make it myself. <laughs> and I'm still trying to perfect my recipe, but it's, it's still better than what I'll buy out of these little restaurants out here unless you know someone has a good recommendation for like a good seafood spot in dallas just give me a recommendation if you have it but anyway now i'm about to make my own seafood boil at home and just chill out for the rest of the day because like man that was exhausting i'm not gonna lie mm -hmm.